name is Ryan Brando. I'm a conductor. I graduated from Princeton in 2003 with a major in music and certificates in music performance and conducting and in the study of women and gender. I've been singing with groups since I can remember. I think I was three when I first joined a kids choir. I was in a number of choirs during high school and then actually joined the local symphony chorus with my dad. When I got to Princeton, um, the first thing I did is I got involved right away with the Glee Club and the Chamber Choir and became a member of the Princeton Cats and Jammers. And that was a really great experience for me because I was able to lead that group. So it was my first opportunity to serve really as a conductor. And then when I was a senior, I actually got to conduct um, the Sinfonia, which is a chamber orchestra. My freshman year, I took a course on the symphony. It was taught by Professor Wendy Heller, who is a very dynamic and engaging lecturer. We did a big unit on Mahler II, and it was the first time that I was just totally overwhelmed by the sheer size and scope of what an orchestra and choir are able to do together. I work with many different ensembles all at the same time. I'm the director of the Princeton Pro Musica, which is 100 singers. In Red Bank, New Jersey, I'm the director of the Monmouth Civic Chorus. And then in New York City, where I live, I'm the director of Amar Artists, which is a small chamber choir. I'm on the faculty at Westminster Choir College, which is in Princeton. I'm constantly swimming in more than one piece of music, and music of different um, time periods, and music of different sizes. So I feel like it keeps, my, keeps all my knives really sharp. Being a conductor is this interesting mix. You have to have that quiet, focused time to learn the music, and then a lot of time with a lot of people, and I just love that. Right now I'm working with Princeton Pro Musica on the all-night vigil of Rachmaninoff. It has an atmosphere. The sense of chant and the sense of the Eastern Church just permeates the whole work. And so a big part of my job too is helping the singers recognize what that atmosphere is, helping them hear it and helping them realize how their individual line contributes to that big picture. I'm somebody who loves puzzles. Every week I'll do the crossword and um, you know, since I was a little kid and I always have that feeling when I'm dealing with music that I'm trying to solve usually a very beautiful puzzle, but I'm, I'm trying to work with 100 people, 200 people to all together solve some kind of puzzle. <laughs>